Hey everyone, this is Andrew Ty and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we're going to show you how to get the game StarCraft Remastered working on macOS Ventura on the M1 or M2 Apple Silicon Macs. So this video tutorial is basically going to show you how to go ahead and download Battle.net for macOS and also get StarCraft Remastered working on this hardware. So if you haven't subscribed already then please consider subscribing and you'll be able to keep up to date with the latest Mac gaming tutorials. So we're going to go to the Battle.net website, which I'll leave a link to in the description. And then we're going to press this button, which is download battle.net. And this is going to take us to the downloader. We're going to allow downloads from blizzard.com, press allow. And once that's downloaded, we're going to go down and open Finder. Then we're going to go to our downloads folder and then double click on battle.net dash setup. So here it's asking us whether we're sure we want to open it, press open. So here it's asking for language. We're going to press continue. And now we're going to enter our local administrator password and then press OK. So this is saying it's updating battle.net update agent. Here we're going to type in an administrator password again and press update settings. So now it's asking us where to install. We're going to let it install in its default location. I'm going to uncheck launch battle.net when the computer starts, press continue. Now it's going ahead and downloading and installing battle.net. So here it's saying it's starting battle.net. So now we're going to log in with our username and password. So if you've not used battle.net, you can go ahead and create a free battle.net account. You're going to need this if you want to play any Activision or Blizzard games on your Mac. I already have an account with games, so I'm going to press the login button here. And then I'm going to type in my email address and password. So when you open up for the first time, it's going to scan for games, but I'm going to press close here and then continue. Here it's giving us the tour of the launcher, telling us how to find games and our friends list, etc. So we're going to find on the main menu of the launcher are all of the games that you can download and install. So there's a whole bunch here. And you also have our favorites bar at the top here. If you go to the shop section, you can basically buy and purchase many different games. Just be aware if you're trying to run these on the Mac, only some of these are available for Mac operating system. So just make sure to check before you download and buy anything. For example, we can't run Call of Duty Warzone or games like Call of Duty Vanguard, etc. Those don't have Mac versions, but plenty of others do. So next, what we need to do is to find the game StarCraft Remastered. So if you don't have this already, you can buy this from the shop. You can do a search for StarCraft in the shop and then click on StarCraft Remastered and then make a purchase. And then once it's added to your account, go to the games section here. We're going to scroll down and find StarCraft Remastered. Here, we're going to click on this and then we're going to press the install button and then we're going to install it into its default location. This is asking us to put it into the applications folder. So once already, you're going to press start install. We're going to need 6.2 gigabytes of space in order for this to work, just press start anyway. And then this is going to take a little bit of time to complete its download. Just wait for that to complete before we move on to the next step. So once StarCraft Remastered has downloaded, we can go ahead and press the play button and then it's going to go ahead and launch. So I'm just going to put the game into window mode to show that it works on Mac OS. I'm going to open up a Brood War single player campaign. And you can see basically that some of the enhanced graphics are there. If you press the F5 button, then it'll switch back to the classic original graphics. And if you press F5 again, it'll toggle back to the remastered graphics. So this is all working correctly on Mac OS. So StarCraft here is running as an Intel application through the Rosetta 2 translation layer. However, it's quite an old game, so it doesn't really matter that it runs on a translation layer. It actually works really well, even with the enhanced graphics. So anyway, this is how you get StarCraft Remastered working on the M1 Apple Silicon Mac on Mac OS Ventura. I've got lots of other video tutorials like this on my YouTube channel, so please check it out. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.